walking along. First and foremost, I want to give our praises to you. How I want to show you how to shine, how I want to show you how to crash. Don't want to send two elders in the process of breaking the stone. And show you how to rise and mount you, pushing the sword in sincerity and in truth. And I believe you how to bring us back from camp to Mr. Meek. I'm not, I'm right. Yeah, yeah. I'm not. No. And um, today I just want to touch on um, the topic, um, God's willing, as the priest had said, um, is it may be peaceable with our men, right? if it's possible. Right? So let's uh, start off with the priest upon now, so this will be the final two that go there on the Hebrews. Alright, so this is the book of Hebrews chapter 12, verse 14. It says, Follow peace with all men, and holiness, without which no man shall see the Lord. Yeah, so you follow peace with all men, you know, is it may be try to be peaceable. Right, and um, this is that um, being a tyrant is in your um, is somewhere near them saying, I've never been a weak Jew. No, is in where meek and humble people, you know, especially the meek shall inherit the, 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 um, the hurt. I always try in him, uh, well, you know, say, uh, seriously, the zeal um, at, the, at the most I can um, eat him up, you know, and he thought the, way the wicked people in my temple, you know, is in what, besides that, you know, he was a calm man. Right, the disciples them as well, Paul as well, you know. And the scripture said, um, let's give me this look at Romans chapter 15, 15 verse 4. Yeah. Alright, this is Romans chapter 15, verse 4. For whatsoever things were written, afore time were written for our learning, that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. Exactly. So the events them we get written in the scriptures, yo, is the for our learning. Right? So we can know how to basically um what kind of character we supposed to have? Is my all supposed to um go about our daily walk in the spirit? Right. Is it me? So we have um also we bring out the example with King David. Is it with um I'll also also bring forth an example with um Paul, right? The Apostle Paul. Because they them our example, you know, all basically um go about in the spirit. Right? So um let me give you something. Alright, you can go in our room and so no question. Right, this is Romans chapter 12, starting at verse 14. Bless them which persecute you. Bless and curse not. Alright, so bless them who persecute you. Is it mean, we know some of my persecution come from them when I Israel. We know there's a balance to it. Is it mean, can't drop that. Because some, some other straight up demon. Is it mean, Paul tells you, you basically um, offer one up to Satan. Is it mean, but nevertheless, you know, you're not supposed to take this thing personal. Is it mean? And that, 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 that's the level, you know, if a man basically a blaspheme against the whole boy Shemiel Shai, is it me, you don't know, and, and basically straight up a deceive people like Francis and Snake, is it me, you know, more straight up devil, right, you know, yeah, the scripture say, you know, um, the scripture was made for what, um, rebuke, right, so rebuke him, you know, right, the scripture ever tells you, um, you believe the, the angel, is it me, you know, by the, the state of the name, so never bring up, you know, um, right in accusation against Satan, when we say, the Lord rebuke you, right, you know, how, um, they're here, at a shatan. Right now I take no person like him on basically this DJ or see we see it under the job. And that's how supposed to preach as well, yo. Is it when demon jump on him people, yo? God with the pre what the story Job. Is it me? Right? I most I tell Job um uh, tell Satan to go test Job. Right? So Satan the name bidding. So if you have a spiritual mindset behind things yo, when a man basically come up to you, is he man like let my try a or something like that, yeah, he must say, alright, I just have my trial. God. Right, especially when we say in the we will like Israel like, get saved. Is it me? Right, so yo, bless them, yo. Is it me? I want to say something to you. Um, get me um, Proverbs 15, verse 1, over Is it me? I want to say something to you. I'll be like, for instance, they're on the street and I want to say, I'll be a fuck, you know, I teach. I'm saying, you know, I'll tell the police, you know, yo, you can go on. Is it me? Or, uh, the scripture said, you have it. Alright, go on. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 15, verse 1. A soft answer turn it away wrath, but grievous words stir it up anger. Yeah, so for instance, let's say the man walk past and saw you fuck when you teach and you, your reaction was, fuck off, is it me? Like, we went dead the most I went kill or something like that. We know at times you always in your spirit warranty, right? But what we're supposed to do, I try to be uh, more, more subtle with things, yo. I suppose Yahweh should have said, is it me? So what be old if they can't get me from your queen? Um, be a sheep among um, wolves. Matthew chapter um, chapter 10 okay. verse 16 okay. uh, so say Matthew chapter 10 verse 16 
Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Alright, harmless as dove is merely wise like serpent, and serpent is something more subtle, you know? go about him here, he basically he can creep up on you without um, being aware. Right? That's how supposed to move to you, you're supposed to um, go to and um, every man says, see their brawling when everybody tells you, you're most like going to kill you. You see me, or you see some fuck at you just start cussing them out and all oh, your man most like kill you. No, you'll be subtle. Because mm -hmm. remember, harmless. So when I take up weapons, you see me like we have go against two thirds or we have go against. So we don't even know who is two thirds. It's me who is the most they are destroyed. Or as the nation of Israel. Or we are always going to try to fight against the so called white man. No. You see me, be subtle with things, yo. I just finish on the Proverbs. Then go to verse 2. This is verse 2. See, it says, The tongue of the wise use it knowledge aright, but the mouth of fools pour it out foolishness. That's right. right. The mouth of the wise use it word aright. Say, so, you no, know, when we say it, yo, in season. For instance, we know where God say, oh, most say, I kill for God. So, see, listen to me. We don't need highways and hedges, yo. It's the moment things general when it's like one um, um, woman that walk past and say, yo, you bitch, you must say, I kill you. No. You see me? You read from the scriptures and say, yo, the daughters of, um, like, for instance, they can pull um, Isaiah 3, verse 16 on down. Say, because them walk stretched through it and so forth, you must say, I punish them. Okay. Right? But don't make things direct, yo, because we're not seeking a direct confrontation with nobody. We come out here for one purpose only. You see me? Deliver the message. Get the elect, lads, only. You see me? I can out a year. Is when enough you know, know confrontation no man and debate in the scripture. Like for instance, you see the apostles then I push it hard. I believe that people listen to him and say, oh, I'm gonna pass the go by and say I'm not around for black people you now. Okay. Is it when yeah, I sit yo? Right? Um as we get down one other one as well now when Paul tells Peter say servant of the most I must not strive. Is it gonna continue this in uh, Romans twelve? I think that's the second Peter yeah. um, chapter two or verse fourteen. Back in Romans 12, verse 15. Rejoice with them that do rejoice, and weep with them that weep. Be of the same mind one toward another. Mind not high things, but condescend to men of low estate. Alright, so you basically want to meet money, yo. You see, your father, um, go after the spirit of them of low estate, yo. Basically, be meek. Yahushua was a meek person. You see, me? King David was a meek person. Right, humble. And that are the characteristics that we're supposed to have in this field, you know? And if you go, go back and front with people, or we are call it good book with people, no. It's not supposed to be humble and something in this life. Um, one second. Um, Being not wise in your own conceits, recompense to no man evil for evil. Okay, see, so the recompense of man evil for evil, you know? Is it me? Right, just because a man um, says some negative to you and the mic, it's a praise of all you know, you're not supposed to be your feelings about nothing. You see me? A man will call it them on the roadside, chop, you know, start doing chop. You see me? Somebody have to do that, you know, the most. I say, yo, what, you know, take your spirit from you. You see me? Because you cannot be out this up. Right? We're supposed to just pray and say, yo, if the most I will, you see me? Basically, bring the light onto this is right, you see me? And they come to you full. Because people say, yo, even the heaven, um, the angels, them, which I is in one when I elect repent. One, I right, basically pray for going to the kingdom, yo. Is in when Jake, Israelites, which are so called Negroes, in America, and Spanish and Latinas, in an right mind. Can you see the people who, who we basically are trying to help for instance, Let's say I'm some negative to you today. Is in your call a devil, is in your, you know, follow Nathan, call a rapist, or a pedophile, or whatsoever. Is it me? And the most I put the spirit on him, is it me? I take that person and I want to kill that man. And the most I put the spirit on that person, he just can repent the next day. Where are you? You have to drop that shit. Is it me? So I'm only walking and taking on the person and you pray everything spiritual. Right? Stay in the spirit. This is the book of James, chapter 3, verse 13. Who is a wise man and endowed with knowledge among you? Let him shoo out of a good. Conversation is words with meekness of wisdom. But if ye have bitter envy and strife in your hearts, glory not and lie not against the truth. See? Bitter envy in your heart, yo. Is it just bitter everything? We know why it's supposed to show the person make us a wise man. But um, what we actually have to establish is the balance. Things, yo. 
is it being supposed to have his meat and everything? Is it not ready for child high and everything? They are in the destination, right? And we see, we see every you now what the apostles said, is it not even the Dallas camp? I'm mean, just merely taking them to camp, me. is it me? Right, but um, for instance, you see, man, come up to yell at them, they yeah, just laugh and say, yeah, me and your apostles say, no, it is, you know, not even take me as serious again. You know, you know, you know, you know, you get mad again, which I just when you really understand or really take this, you know, is it me? Right, you know, so everybody has played them part and we are all in prophecy. Claro. Is it so it just continues and say, this wisdom, this, um, it's like, this wisdom descended not from above, but is early. Same place. Is in verse 15. See, this wisdom descended not from above, but is earthly, sensual, devilish. For where envy and strife is, there is confusion and every evil word. Exactly. You know, for instance, they say um, a man come to the camp and he want to prove a point and he want to prove a point and he come in out this um, we call it strife. You know, edification come out like more than two men go back and forth. Exactly. Is it me? And um, lads and lads say, well, I get it to you. Servant of the Lord must not strive when you're not striving, you know. Is more of an argument with nobody. Yeah, I think it might get, um, for instance, a conversation might get eaten. Is it because we are men? Well, this, that's the one. Is it where supposed to come to level where you can balance out things, yo? Is it something not profitable? You drop it. Is it because you say what? Everything is supposed to be done for the sake of edifying. So you can, you can basically confront a man. Is it me? Like, I don't know where like, the audience at times and the camera. Is much another audience where like, I upload the videos onto the YouTube. The, um, the unicorn internet, right? And I uh, had a brother that can see, say, yo, basically, this type of action, this is the person you are bringing, and when the scripture come out, you get caught this up. Right. Isn't so, this is the action you are foolish, and you build up the, um, the, um, the, the, you basically show the scripture to be true. Isn't so, if you're profitable, dear, so you can, by all means, isn't it? But if you point this, you drop it. Right? Yeah. Drop it like a bad habit. Right. See? So, this is the book of Seth and Timothy. And all the human issues first. Uh, back in Romans chapter 12, verse 17, recompense no man evil for evil, provide things honest in the sight of all men. If it be possible, as much as lieth in you, be peaceably with all men. Yes, sir. If it be possible, because I know you have some nigga out there where you just have to steal to the new year, man. <laughs> Isn't it? But if it be possible, you be subtle. Right? As people say, right? You, um, as a wise sir, um, this, um, I said, as a white serpent, you'll be as a white serpent and leave peace with our men. It's a certain money does not say you just don't bring scripture to this man, you see me? For instance, if they are place, you know you don't need to teach them. You see me? Right? If they mean an argument, you know, just as as um, Paul said, you see me, but Paul said, Paul should you be so to you and say with, um, to them that are without the law and pretend to be without the law, you see me? But with the law, yeah, how about you know, shy? Right? As they see us and yet show. So enough time, no point to remember one time, <laughs> right? Um, we go, um, we don't have a record, so we don't have a record, but we um, go basically say, I believe in the Bible, and I'm shocked. Say, do you believe in the Bible? I say, yeah. <laughs> is it me? But I don't bring certain arguments with them, you know, they might chat you, is it me? And I mean that, is it me? And sometimes they might like, go up on a certain topic, you know, and because you know, a Christian TV vibration, if you are cursed by the word allegedly, you are a Christian, a Christian. Is it right to believe in the Bible? But you can post for those moons, you can take things, say, yo, is it me, yeah, man, is it me, one of them, but I had an idea, yo, that it does, um, what do you call it now? The, the, the clock can't, is it me, you put out in a row, yo, because we have to get by. Right, so, you die in your workplace, so you live peaceable with your co workers, them, is it me, if you give any family, you live peaceable with your family members, them, is it me, you interact with people, you as much as light with you, you live peaceful with them, is it me? And yes, you die your work and see people and you have to go, oh, say, I kill you. You know, friend, you have to go. You can't do them thing. <laughs> you can't even say it's okay. You see? Say, so, yeah, man. Kill yourself. Okay. You can't you fuck you and kill yourself. Mm. You see, man. The scripture tells us, say, yo, um, if you rebuke a wise man, you never love you. If you rebuke a fool, you never hate you. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, the scripture gets the balance of discernment. So, you know who you can say certain things to and who you can't say certain things. And you go in. And you go in. Is it right? Mm -hmm. Finish there. Mm -hmm. That's not okay. Alright, All right, back in Romans 12, verse 19. Dearly beloved, avenge not yourselves, but rather give place unto wrath. For it is written, 
vengeance is mine. Yeah. Give place unto right, your speaker said, be hungry and said not. Because so, how shall I say, wait, as in, as um, the priest of where we call a quote you, as he's reading, vengeance is mine, how shall I say, wait you upon me? How will arise and I hope to the prayer? So, yeah, how shall I defend me? We don't have time to try to justify ourselves or defend ourselves to nobody, yo. They defend my character by all means, the way you want to say, the way you want to say, we don't care. When he start, start to um, put up on the screen and call it terrorists and rapists and pedophiles like we need to do, we don't have we don't have character try to clear, yo. Is it remember one time we go up on the beach, cherry of, um, um, what do call it? Um, comment board, is me little live stream. I said, I mean, I say, yo, me and my friend Jamie said, I tell you, no, no, we don't teach you, you're supposed to go with the rape. Them shot it. Is it supposed to say, oh, we said, damn, this man, I talk to you. <laughs> right? A person tell you, say, yo, yeah, we apartheid group, no, do that. He said, but they don't want to get it, yo. Is it? So, the certain, certain thing they ain't in a long debate with nobody. Okay. You know, back and forth, you know, try to defend yourself, yo. Is it because we know so offensive, as Scripture said? Offensive What's must come, is it but who want to them? Who basically um, cause the offense, yo. Right? So we have to get offended, yes, you know, like them have to cause offense. Right? But we know so we are the right. Because people say, we want to harm you if man speak good about you. Because so did their fathers have the false prophet. We are blessed if man speak evil of you. Because the same, so then we are shine the scripture said, the servant is not greater than his master. If them be good, um, then call the house shine bears go. You see, them kill the apostle them. All the prophets say, the scripture said, which one of them they kill? So the same lot we feel, yo. So we're supposed to understand the balance of things. And we say, they might do them job. You see, man, we don't know who are part of the elect, so we can take things personal. So let's have to live peaceable while we are among these people until the house shall come get with the hell out of here. That's when we are part of the elect. We can just continue to do Alright. Verse 19. Uh, Romans 12, verse 19. Dearly beloved, Avenge not yourselves, but rather give place unto wrath. For it is written, Vengeance is mine. I will repay, say the Lord. Therefore, if thine enemy hunger, feed him. If he thirst, give him drink. For in so doing, thou shalt he coals of fire on his head. Yeah. It's like, yo, a man, uh, as I um, remember them, you watch a video, for instance, some way, change like how um, they call it faces. Is it me? I want to say to you negatively, like you might try to get you hungry, or right? people say what? Um, in Proverbs 15, verse 1, he said, um, um, grievous herbs serve hunger. So you have self answer to it away, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, so for instance, yeah, I want to try to get you pissed off, or say something negative, you know, shake it off, yo. Know? It's me, I give him a compliment. <laughs> is it me? So you know, shoes bad, though. You know, Jake, look, compliment. compliment. Mm -hmm. Yes, change the face, yo. Know? Is it me? I didn't even say my cousin. You know? Okay, what? We must not strive, but you have to be said, you know, so the whole book of Second Timothy chapter two verse twenty three is he ain't but foolish and unlearned questions avoid. Yeah, foolish and unlearned questions was a question I'm in a sense, is it me? Jacky. Is it me we're not being attention to that? Why? Knowing that they do gender stripes. Mm -hmm. Is it? Like uh, this nigga there asks me, say, yo, um, about when the woman is on her period, you see me? If you if got a vider. I tell him, say, yo, what about the law set? You see me? At the end of the day, it will cause me to stand by the back end of the law. You see me? And because I can, I can do that. You see me? He might call me an idiot for that. You see me? So at the end of the day, you know where I'm going. Don't cause a pearl and the swine. Don't cause that kind of knowledge. And the swine, the space for you have a nice day and walk off or some shit like that. You see? Because I'm a traffic, um, basically gender strife. You see? And the servant of the Lord must not strive, but be gentle unto all men, up to teach patient. You understand? So, in the final situation, as scripture tells us, so, mm -hmm. and the third time we're out, for in the final mm -hmm. situation where you know, if you go in a heated conversation, see, the best thing to do is just either you walk off, you respond with a soft answer. You see me? Or just basically just lift them, lift them to time. You know, the scripture says, oh, you know, many times it's a lot, you know, repair. You know, try to be even diffused, like, give you tensions and the camps. You know, never come up in and get, get touched. 
And if you tell you, say, oh, this, the description, you know, is if you shot up and I told you the story. Mm-hmm. When you're in the talk, you know, sometimes a man get cut. Is if you're instead of all going on physical confrontation, and then you try to refuse the situation, you know. Is if you're going to say, a person like you, a pull it out, is if you're going to say, you know, you're going to say, you know, go against each other, you're going to free. Right? Mm-hmm. Um, you will call some say your brother, I'm going to say, well, I'm going to say, you don't believe in a Bible too, you don't believe in a God. Is it so you have a fight a man, but just have tried to bring out the scriptures? Is yeah. it? <laughs> and more when I want to come up and say, they say something offensive, they'll come out of the Bible. You see, and one like him and say, we all say, yeah, we don't know me, he said nothing. <laughs> Look, why don't you read the scripture again, brother? You see, you never say nothing. And the word say, I'm going to stand by the word, that's it. You know, believe in the Bible too. What do you believe in the Bible? So we hear the Bible like you said. <laughs> See? You, see? Uh, you get yourself out like for instance, you remember when you link the Christopher, the mother said, you're working with them. And I said, oh, you're yeah, extreme. You sound like everyone. I said, brother, I don't mean that. <laughs> hey, Bible, that sounds extreme. Yeah, I don't mean, brother. Like it. So you take yourself out of that situation. Straight. Is it me? I'm about to talk about me. I just have a message. Sir. I'm just reading. Exactly. Right? So me and I have no meaning. <laughs> As they are, what should I say? And the way they hear. Is he a him? And his father, his father is not man, but mm. the father would say. See, I'm a dead one, Bridget. Me and I are nothing. Is he me? This no curse story between me and I. Mm. I'm just doing my job. Don't hear the messenger. Exactly. Because <laughs> I'm going to start saying, oh, we're just a weatherman. We're just telling you what the weather going to be, man. Exactly. <laughs> if you do wickedness, you won't say I kill you. If you do righteousness, you might get um, mercy. That's it. Nothing more. Nothing personal. You have to always make what it as well. And the scripture say, they say, we are what, what be gentle unto all men. Have to teach patient in meekness instructing those that oppose themselves if God pray a preadventure will give them repentance to the acknowledging of the truth that's right they say now meekness you know instruct them because at the end of the day they're truly ignorant of what they are the deeds they want to do so through our meekness we are trying to put up what we are put off to them is it my preadventure they will father bring them to the fold and basically clarify the knowledge man. Mm-hmm. is it? Yeah, for instance, if you're growing up here, is it me? let's say you have some money where you want you really want to attack like um, physically is it what no matter where you go at this person you think you like a soft and say it's a normal teacher it's like you know what you, you know how the like for instance the thing where really get the more heat you know I like when you get resistance is it what if you obviously push a negative vibe on a person or push a positive vibe so it about diffuse all your negative vibes yo yeah. is it me? Um, you can read the next verse in this. Um, that's what I'm so, Alright, that's one. So this is the book of Titus, chapter 3. Let me start that one. It says, But put in mind to be subject to principalities and powers, to obey majesties, to, do re- to be ready to every good work, to speak evil of no man, to be no brawlers, but gentle, showing all meekness unto all men. We yes, we ourselves also were like were sometimes foolish. You hear the scripture says, we ourselves, we who they know the truth, we who come to the knowledge and understanding of the scriptures. Right? So we have to know of evil people. You see, from mm-hmm. people. So yeah, we are the nigger too. The way fool just like you. Can. You want them to try to show a person something like that, you brother. Me used to grow up in a Christianity. See how they bullshit them when you believe? Me used to believe them too. Me not much better than you. Can. The fact is that me here is just like what you hear to it. I see him so me hear it too. Me never hear me, me, me grew up and I say, yo, um, when we get the truth, I say, yo, we must say, I kill all the people. Is the same way you shock into you, you shock into me too. Okay. Is it me, me no much better, yeah, we, we basically, me maybe you ten times or so on the things that you already know. It's about the end of the day, yo, it's to say, God, this is how we're good under repentance. Right. right, so you get caught, yo, do us all, do us us. Is it me, we go, yo, we're wrong, we're wrong, all right, let's go over here. I want to bring yeah. up to this day. Is it me, so you have to always remember that as well, man. I say, yo, see, see, and... He go, he's go as well as um, even King David, he made the prayer. He said, yo, take not your Holy Spirit from me. And cast me not away from my presence. Because the most I can take him free from any time. Right. Is it not the same one where you are despised? Is it not the one pan? And of course what? Is it me? The most I can put in spirit pan that man. Put him in I can pan kick you out. Right. As you're supposed to always make you one humble. And no one say, yo, this way have is a gift you can get take off from you, yo. So just yeah. is it? So for we ourselves also were sometimes foolish, disobedient, deceived, serving diverse lusts and pleasures, living in malice and envy, hateful and hating one another. You see? 
But after that, the kindness and love of God our Savior toward man appeared. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, back in the book of Timothy, you see, he said, in meekness instructing those that oppose themselves, if God peradventure will give them repentance to the acknowledging of the truth. You see, in meekness, he instructs them who oppose them in themselves. So, if peradventure, if the most I will, they will be able to be honest and repent. So, you don't take things personal, try to do my head. No, you know, you know, this man, Tutor. So much when you as if I'm on the case, if I'm on black seal, is it when you know, you can repent that you can marry with this man. Is it me if you break it down to the simplest for more you can, and a man still can get it, you know, so I read that well, at least always time as a man. So the mindset behind it is um, the meekness, is it me where you do behind it on the level of humility, and take things personal, you know, and I believe you are, you are the shit, or you are the person, or you are the man. I went on the body, yo. Let's give us a wise there to an ashes pro. Then, continuing, verse 26. And that they may recover themselves out of the sneer of the devil, who are taken captive by him at his will. Right. So them get deceived, yo, because the most side, because the army say, who oh, will pursue him? I want to say there's a deceptive spirit. I give us a them hard fight. This is a man, them, them ears, every day, them can't hear. Is him said the most I want to lift up that spirit up for them to me to understand his will, not mine. Is him we just come out here at the one minute. Go out there, is him we speak this word, but then I want to hear when I want from here. We don't take things personal. You know? I want to win our flesh at times, it might chip in you. Know? But I just always remember the balance. Is him and I go out there and I'm, all right, this man just wicked. Is him, right? Skip say, yo, you give um, when it, 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 when is it me? Right? Them, them, them think who, that we are some negative person or devil worship and so forth. And we're out there in the world, you is it me? The man beg you like all the people they look fear. So you see it, yeah. Is it me? It's like front and smuddy, this this person need help you, you help them. But you know that balance. Right? right? It's, you put the scripture, cast not your purse on the swine. Mm-hmm. So it's in Trump, you know, then you next. And I see so when those, when those do us good, you know to whom do it. You see me, so everything I with balance, yo, and then just you have to get the balance if you don't have to get perfect. You see me, and at times you have to, you have to, you see me, come on, I'll get it perfect, come on, perfect, until you have to shy forward, you see me, come out of this fish. You see me, but um, the scripture said, this is the condition of the bottle. Um, report the scripture, we know those who. Mm-hmm. So this is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 12, verse 1. So when thou will do good, know to whom thou doest it, so shall thou be thanked. For thy benefits. Yeah, for instance, you see a man, you know a man I love bone weed. Is me a smoke yeah, young. I'm a big guy fifty. You know, me not have a brother. Is me hard. And this balance too, because you look at him and say, you know, you know, so me not have a broke like that. Mm-hmm. Is me said I tell him, fuck off. Is me not have a man. Is me? Right. Is me a balance? 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 Or what you can do is that you can apply the law because scripture basically shows you the lame that are among you. Um, you so whatever they're not lying or whatever they're supposed to actually take care of them. You see, if you see a man uh, crippled, a man blind, a man in a wheelchair, a man in a hand and a foot, can't help himself, so to speak. You have a spirit change. You give him a dollar. You see? No, I kill him. I kill him. Which I believe right out of the priest of the night, but I'm going to finish it. You see? Saying, so shall thou be thanked for thy benefits, do good to the godly man, and thou shalt find a recompense, and if not from him, yet from the Most High. There, um, there can no good come to him that is always occupied in evil. He's always occupied in evil. So he's a balance, so you have some money to do evil because they really right. know better. Is a mere some in a one day situation, right? But as, as we give the example, yo, is it me? Right? You know, this man will take money definitely by a way to you not know, give. Right. Is it me? Well, if you know, like, for instance, you, know, you look on a man's face and you say, so you're hungry, strike him left, right, and center. Is it me? You have it, because you can tell you. Is it me? If you make the needy, right, if you cry, is it me? And the most I hear, you just get fucked. Is it me? Because the most I bless you with funds, not saying you're supposed to take you with the money and give you poor, because you have know, always have a poor, which as you have, what I say. Yeah. Is it me? Um, the woman, you have, what I say. Is it me? Say, yo, no, we have always have a poor. 
is the Mr. Dears Bonnet. So we know the brothers them, you have to take care of brothers them first. Okay. Is the main, and then if you have, as the brothers, if you have a spirit change, you're not just begging your money, you know, see that. Is mm -hmm. it me? Is it me? The blessing, he, he made him happy, he would. Is it me? And who to tell me, me see on the roadside and people talk shit. No, man, I got them money at all, so. It's like your brother in like a car, yo. He's in a map against the uh, foreign sense and go look for a woman and my teeth say, you want to look for a woman too? And my need a woman take him and take him. My need a woman take her on. He said, damn man, yeah. Like she said, we are fish. Is it me? And my mother said, no man, no damn man. Yeah. Is it me? Right. Yeah. You can understand. Yeah. See, see, there can no good come to him that is always occupied in evil, not him that give it no help. Give to the God the man and help not a sinner. Do well unto you. Which, if you understand, you know, there's no support. Okay? Well, we are sinner. <laughs> yes, yeah. the so all have sinned and come um, short to the glory of our worship your shy. So, of course, you have to apply the balance here, you couldn't even give it to yourself then. <laughs> yeah. Because the scripture says, any man saying that I say, he's a liar, the truth is not in him. Right, so we may be able to scripture actually refer to here as man who can stand in a sin, you know, care about the Lord the most. Because you know, fuck me then, then, and you know, give a shit about them. I brought to help a man with the kindness of the heart. He basically has a basically enlightened mind to lead um, to, the, to the right way. Mm -hmm. you see me? Because, funny enough, when I was coming into the truth, you see, it, was, it was one of those meek acts that brought me closer. Because I heard of the brothers them say, uh, um, people say a lot of things about them in the communities, saying they them a body man, they them a cult, a cult and all these things. And just in the street one day I walk, and I just feel a presence behind me. When I look back, you see, the brother look for me, you see, and him smile, you see me? So the smile was so welcoming that my brother's feet to just stop and ask my question. And through that interaction, it just leads to the whole of this right now, man. you see? And the other day when I when, when read about the same thing, he tell me what I think about it. It's like, in the, at the time, he smiled, but in his mind, he said, Oh God, and then he scoffed. You see? <laughs> so, like, he would expect scoffing, which I will even, um, therefore, the scripture will say, Yo, um, Take happily whatever is brought upon you. You see, he take it cheerfully. So, he look like he would brace himself for scoffing, but at the end of the day, the meekness where he actually bring off, he actually win a sword. You understand? So, it's just like that, man. Yes, I think they can stop it. Alright, it says Matthew chapter 5, verse 38. You have heard that it had been said, an eye for an eye, and a tooth for a tooth. But I say unto you, that ye resist not evil. But whosoever shall smite thee on the right cheek, turn to him the other also. Yeah, and go in mercy of his human balance. And say if a man comes to thump in your face, you'll mean say, you'll see, see that thump in. No, you defend yourself, yo. Right, but if a man offend oh, you, yo. <laughs> if a man offend you, you see me, you can't let it go, make it go on. A man step by your toe, you see me, and be by accident. That one day, you buy a spot, you have to start and go your business. Because I never really kill you, yo. Brush off your shoes and go on my business. Right, and um, even if you bread them, you see me, if a man offend you, you see me. Right, the scripture tell you what you both would be, but certain things you can have a single shake off. Right? You still lay here, still not shoot, you ain't know, lose nothing. You still have your hand on your foot. You mm -hmm. me? Right? Continue. Right? And if any man will sue thee at the law and take away thy coat, let him have thy cloak also. And whosoever shall compel thee to go a mile, go with him twain. Give to him that asketh thee, and from him that would borrow of thee, Turn not to away. Ye have heard that it had been said, Thou shalt love thy neighbor and hate thine enemy. But I say unto you, Love your enemies, bless them that curse you, do good to them that hate you, and pray for them which despitefully use you and persecute you. Yeah, and um, the scripture tell us straight to say how oh, the enemy are going to beat them up your own soul. That's so we're not talking about Esau. I know other nations. I know other nations, you know. The scripture that talk about all these things applicable to Israel, man. His mercy, his meekness, is applicable to the nation of Israel. Mm -hmm. See? To hell with that evil. 